Meg is experiencing that as she does every single year. But you're loving cruising this year, huh? As we celebrate 20 years. Can you believe it, Kim? I'm telling you, what a wonderful day this has been. And so many of us are often busy hopping in and out of cars all day long. And we really don't stop to take a moment just to realize how much of a challenge it can be for others. But the joy of going down Woodward during the cruise is just the same. It's great to get out of the house, you know. I'm either in my chair or my bed, and now I get a chance to ride in an awesome convertible. Dozens of people like 20-year-old Trey Cools with spinal cord injuries normally bound to a wheelchair are getting quite a spin thanks to the D-Man Foundation. I've been in my wheelchair for three years and been riding in minivans and high top cars and every time I pull up some place I get you know I have to get used to the looks that I get when I roll out of my ramp and this is totally something uh, out of this world for me and a totally great experience to get out of my chair in a car convertible even and just just drive like a like a normal person you know because she's stuck in a um, van so being able to ride in a convertible and stuff she likes it. D-Man stands for Danny's Miracle Angel Network. Z Kassab started the nonprofit foundation in honor of his brother Danny. I hit by a car when he was seven years old and was paralyzed from the neck down. And uh, he lived an awesome life, though. And on Sundays, we used to just throw him in my mom's convertible and, and go cruising. Fortunately, we lost him in 2009, and uh, in honor of him, we started the D-Man, Danny's Miracle Angel Network Foundation after him. And people like Reverend Hot Rod here are the angels who give their time and the opportunity for their new friends to ride shotgun in a fabulous convertible. I've always had a heart for people that aren't as privileged as we are, and uh, if I can give, uh, just, you know, I love it. I really enjoy doing it. We're having a great time. And what a wonderful thing they're doing for so many wheelchair-bound folks. And if you want to learn more about the D-Man Foundation, just give me a few minutes. I'm going to run back to the truck, and I'll put it up on our website at WXYZ.com. Reporting live in Royal Oak, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Back to you.